Hey everybody, I've been having trouble with my uh, Minn Kota Altera trolling motor holding spot lock. Uh, it drifts quite a bit, up to 20 feet sometimes. So I'm going to uh, calibrate the heading sensor, which is this piece here. And then I'm going to show you the steps on how to do that. It's pretty simple. So let me get this camera turned around and I'll show you how we do it. Okay, so the first step we're going to do is uh, we have our trolling motor. It's deployed. We are out of the way. Uh, you want to do this on a spot where it's not too windy to calibrate it and then obviously free of other boats around or any stumps in the water so I'll show you how we're going to do this we're going to go use our arrows here we're going to drop down hopefully you can see this in the with the glare we're going to scroll down towards the system we're going to hit the soft key on the right now we're going to scroll down towards says sensor uh, calibrate so hit the check mark press start now when we press start it's going to ask us to do two turns of the trolling motor so i'll show you how that is all right so you want to turn but you don't want to turn too fast but you don't have to do it very slow either it has a little pie chart thing that shows you uh, where you're at in your turns if you don't know but it'll tell you when it's finished as well speed up just a little bit so I did this calibration of the day but it still wasn't working so I went online uh, to Minkota's app through their site uh, with the iPilot app and there is an update for my trolling motor so I did the software update so now that the software update is done, that's why I'm going to do the calibration and see if that will help hold its spot lock uh, much closer. It should be within five feet, but it's been going up to 20 feet several on several trips. So if it continues, I will have to take it in and have them look at it. I've had my other two previous on my other boats did the same thing within that year. I had to take it in and they had to uh, replace something up in the head of the trolling motor. All right, we're almost finished with this and we are there so I'm gonna stop the troll and I'm gonna turn off the propeller it says calibration successful please perform the sensor offset so to the sensor offset we're gonna hit the back button with the soft key scroll down one and there's the sensor offset we're gonna hit the check mark so it says point the motor forward and parallel to the keel. So you want to try to get it lined up as straight as possible. So that looks pretty straight. I'm going to hit set and it says I'm one degree offset. So you know, when you do your heading sensor at the back when it's installed, there's an arrow and you want to line that up as parallel to the keel as possible. Now you're doing it by the eye, so it's not going to always be perfect. So that's why we're doing this uh, offset here. All right, so that's it. Doesn't take very long to do the calibration of the heading sensor or to do the offset. Just a couple of minutes. So uh, hopefully this will be the fix that I need. Thanks.